Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Can you plug a refrigerator into a regular outlet? Refrigerator. Most refrigerators work with a standard 100 to 120 volt electrical plug and outlet. You will notice that the electrical plug is made up of three prongs. This means you will need an electrical outlet that has three inserts. It is best to use an outlet that has a ground fault interrupter or GFI. Joom. 225-1435 AH. How many amps does a fridge use? Amperage for most household refrigerators is anywhere from 3 to 5 if the voltage is 120. A 15 to 20 amp dedicated circuit is required because the inrush amperage is much higher. The average amperage is lower because the compressor isn't running all the time. This is often measured in kilowatt hours kWh. SAF. 17, 1438 AH. Can you plug a refrigerator into an extension cord? Why you shouldn't plug a refrigerator into an extension cord Extension cords have a thinner wiring compared to regular house sockets. This makes them susceptible to failing and causing a fire especially if the appliances plugged into it or have a wattage that is higher than what the extension cord is rated for. Moo. 12, 1442 AH. Why is my refrigerator tripping the GFCI? The most common reason your refrigerator keeps tripping the GFCI outlet is that it may be somehow getting shorted. Look for exposed wires that may be touching the ground or some water accumulation, causing a short circuit. If there is a shorting, then the GFCI trips save the device from getting damaged in any way. Does a refrigerator require a GFCI outlet? Residential kitchen in a dwelling unit, residential GFCI protection is only required for kitchen receptacles that serve the countertop surfaces. There's no requirement to GFCI protect receptacles that serve a refrigerator. Unless the fridge is plugged into a countertop receptacle. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark.